Hello, in this video I want to show you different ways of joining a channel in Chatty. So the first way is probably the most obvious one because the connect dialog comes up by default when you start Chatty. So here you can just enter a channel name or more than one channel name by separating them with a comma and then it joins these channels when you connect. The second way is the join channel dialog, which basically works the same as the connect dialog, just enter one or more channels and you can join them. The third way is the favorites and history dialog, where all the channels you join automatically get added to, so you can join them more easily later. Um, you can also add favorites which are indicated by the star in front of here. And here you can just right click on the channel and join that channel or select one or more channels and right click and join these channels or click on the button down here or double click on the channel and to join that one channel. There's lots of ways. Okay, way number four is the live streams dialog where all the streams that are currently live and that Chatty knows about it are listed. Um, Chatty knows about channels, uh, streams of channels you have currently joined and also streams you follow. So here you can just right click on a stream and join that channel or select one or more streams and join more than one channel at once. Okay, um, so one other thing, if you join a channel you have currently already joined, then it just switches to that channel. So that goes for any kind of joining. If you join just one channel, if you join more than one channel at once, then it tells you that you've already joined these channels. Okay, way number five is the join command. You can just enter the command in any input box and enter a channel name to join that channel. Pretty straightforward. Way number six is the user context menu. If you right click on a user like this, then it brings up the user context menu and have, you have this option here to join the channel of that user, which sometimes can be useful. Way number seven is the URL context menu. You can, when someone posts like a Twitch URL like this that contains a stream name and Chatty recognizes the link as such, then you can just right click and choose this option to join the associated channel, which can be useful for like rates or something or anytime someone posts a link which has a, like a Twitch link which, which has a stream name in it. Okay, way number eight, probably the least obvious way, but can also be useful is the uh, notifications. When you right click on a not notification, like a notification uh, when a stream goes live or something like that, a stream you follow, then something like that comes up. I just use a command for now to show it. Um, and then you can of course left click on that notification to immediately close it, but you can also right click to, which also closes it, but also joins the channel. So that can be quite useful. The last way, the way number nine is you can also define what Chatty should do when you start it. So it can just do nothing special or it can open the connect dialog, which is the default setting. Or it can also automatically connect and join the channels you specify here. Again, the same as in the uh, connect dialog or the join channel dialog, just enter one or more channel names and separate them with a comma. And it can also join the channels you had previously open when you close Chatty, or it can join channels that are that are your favorites in the favorites and history dialog here, which have the star in front. So that can be used to automatically join channels, connect and join channels when you start up Chatty. Okay, that's it. Um, I hope it was useful and something new in there for you maybe. Thanks for watching and goodbye.